and welcome to the first of my Chili Guru videos for Oaxaca where I'll be showing you step by step how easy it is to grow chilies in your own home. First of all, before you start, you just need a few bits of basic equipment. What you need is you need a pot, you need your Oaxaca chili seeds or whichever chili seeds you decide that you're going to use. Um, just a normal spray that you get from your local hardware store just to moisten off the compost and obviously the crucial ingredient some multi-purpose compost. So the first step is to get your pot and then just fill it up to the top with compost just making sure that what you do is you just firm it down and then once you've done that Get your spray, moisten off the compost just so it gets wet. Now ideally what you should normally do is leave that for half an hour for it to soak through. But we haven't got time today just to do that. So just we'll pretend that's been done. Then if you've got your Oaxaca chili seeds, you get one of the matchsticks, break that off carefully, and then there's a little marker on the matchstick. What you do then is plant it point end down into your compost just down to where the marker is and that's that one planted now if you're using your own chili seeds the only difference that you would need to do is plant your chili seeds on top of the moistened compost then put about another half centimeter of compost on top and then moisten that as well what then needs to happen is then you need to make sure that your chili seeds are warm which will then help them to germinate what you'll need to do there is that either put it in a sunny place, even better is put it on a sunny windowsill above a radiator, or a little trick and a little cheat is to get the pot, put some cling film over the top, and then put that in an airing cupboard. Or alternatively, if you've been a bit naughty and uh, nicked a shower cap from a hotel room, then you'll need to use that as well. Place that over the top and then pop that in the airing cupboard as well. But if you're putting it in the airing cupboard, just make sure that you keep checking on it every couple of days. One, to make sure that the compost hasn't dried out, and two, that the um, seeds haven't germinated. If the compost looks as if it's drying out, then you just need to use the mister again. Just moisten off the compost so that it doesn't dry out. But also, just double check um, that if the seeds have germinated, what you need to do then is take them out of the airing cupboard and then place them on a windowsill because what will happen is if you don't, they end up with very weak leggy plants, which is definitely what we don't want. Um, in the next video I'll be showing you what to do once your seeds have germinated, how to give them some tender loving care and make sure that they grow up into big strong chilli plants. Uh, I'll speak to you then.